Some of the guys, man, they started, um, you know, really well. In the first, obviously, the first uh, drive, and gave up a field goal the second drive, but then we go punt, punt. I think punt, punt. Uh, and then interception, and another punt, and then, then uh, they missed a field goal there, uh, right there at the half, and then came out and again. Uh, first drive, second half defensively, you know, nickel and dime. I think their longest drive on the day was 55 yards, but they 12 play and really made them work, and uh, we end up getting a field goal, and then we go three straight drives of you know turnover on downs and. Again, you know, it's a 50, 55 play drive, 49 yard drive, 26 yard drive, where they're threatening, but uh, the guys just buckle down. I love the the belief, and you know, it takes courage to keep going out there, and things are uh, you know still tight. And um, we talked about that a lot, you know, going into the week. That you know, there's going to be opposition. There's going to be real adversity throughout the course of the season. And don't, you know, we had two of the three weeks with not a whole lot of pushback. And, and obviously uh, today uh, we did. And there's a reason, you know, Cincinnati, you know, has been incredibly difficult to beat, you know, over the last, whatever that has been, a four year span where they, I think today was their third loss. Didn't want to promote that a whole lot, but we did talk about it, uh, you know, a few times during the week, you know, how, Challenging it was going to be, and what a beautiful day for football. Love our fans were amazing on the road, and they were right behind our bench. And our players fed off of them a lot, and it helps. All, everything helps. And uh, but I liked how we complimented each other at the right times, and things were were hard. Sometimes we got in our own way. You know, we had a couple of third downs offensively that um, had to be that we converted that we had to get back uh, because of penalties. And I think we had a shift and maybe a holding uh, penalty uh, there right at the end that would have prevented them from, you know, getting uh, one last drive. And, uh, but, you know, Zach Schmidt nailed a couple of good field goals. I think it was 10-3, 10-3, uh, both halves. And, uh, and that's how you build a team. Like, again, like I said, there's lots of different ways to win. Uh, you know, proud of our guys' effort, you know, uh, both sides of the ball to continue to fight and compete. Offense came out, and you know they had four drives where we we scored. And you know the, one of the field goal drives was a 12 play, 72 yard drive. And there's a couple of plays there that we'd like to get back. We can't, but okay, what do we got to do to to fix that? And, uh, and then we had a, a nine play, you know, 67 yard drive there. Again, we had to settle for a field goal. So we'll work on the efficiency and the execution. Um, you know, there's plenty of mistakes, lots to, to fix. I love to, you know, to win and got to still fix a lot of stuff. <laughs> and, um, uh, but I love the competitiveness of the football team. And, uh, you know, three-stranded cord is hard to, hard to break. And uh, Dylan, again, passed over, you know, 300 yards and had some good tough running uh, at times. And, and again, offensively, Third downs and fourth downs were, were pretty good overall. And again, like I said, we, we, we missed on a couple of opportunities because of some penalties. And, and then def defensively, I'm outstanding. I think they were four of maybe 19 on third and fourth downs. And oh my gosh, that was, uh, you know, just a make, making plays. Guys, just, man, it was fun to watch. Uh, fun to watch those guys. Danny Stussman had 13 tackles. and. Jared Kanick, um, he got hit in the chest, and you know, early results or uh, things seemed to he'll be okay. We had, checked it, had him checked out uh, locally here, and hopefully everything will continue to check out. But um, and uh, then we got some guys in there again. We, we had, you know, R. Mason Thomas, Justin Harrington, Reggie Pearson, uh, you know, didn't make the trip, and uh, Savion Bird, and, but guys stepped up, you know. And through all the, uh, you know, there's good and bad in all of it. But, um, you know, there will be a lot of opportunity to teach and learn and correct. How about Andrew Anthony and some of yeah. the plays he made? Uh, really, again, they, what, what was his, his numbers uh, for the day? Anybody know? Here we go. Anthony had yeah, seven, 117. Uh, 
17 yards after the catch, you know, catching a run. Drake had 36 yards, uh, you know, yards after the catch. And Jalil, you know, had that one tough drop, but he, again, had 32 yards after the catch and uh, catching it and getting vertical. So, uh, again, Andrell's smooth and reliable. He had a 50 yarder, had eight catches, and uh, he was really good. And, uh, but again, just a lot to get better from, a lot to improve on. We accomplished our goal. We <laughs> knew it was going to be hard to come in here. And uh, uh, what was the final? 20 to 6. Won by a couple scores. And, and everybody feels, again, uh, you know, we really felt like, you know, we could have slammed the door earlier in the game. And, uh, but again, give Cincinnati and their staff, their players credit. They kept battling and, and making plays too. You know, that's part of it, it goes both sides. Thanks, Coach. Yep.